Hello guys, today is a different type of video. I'm going to talk about the three web calling um, technologies, Zoom, Google Meet, and Microsoft Teams. Which one is the best and works for your organization? You know with the whole coronavirus and quarantining, people have been working from home, online, and meeting people. So I'm going to talk about the differences and which one should you consider if you want to go that way so we got all these features for for zoom google meets and microsoft teams so i'm gonna start with i'm gonna start with zoom so zoom is a free account available you can access from all devices you can host up to 100 people with the free plan and up to 500 people with the paid plan so most people 100 people is sufficient but if you're doing like a multi casting where you want 500 people or more like a telemarketing or something that's for you you can up to 49 persons on screen and screen sharing and call annotation meeting participants can be held in breakout rooms to hold small group discussion and as many additional features so you can download the app, but the time the negatives are the time limit is 40 minutes. There's some security problems called Zoom bombing, and you have to purchase an audio conferencing plan for calling. So that's those are the negatives for Zoom. Now next is Google Meets. Google Meets has corroboration tools, sending files through chat, and instant messaging full integration with Google Apps, so whatever you do, like Google Drive and Google uh, Excel Sheets and all that is all integrated in the Google Apps. It can all host up to 250 persons for free until September of this year. Uh, there's no additional fee for calling participants. You can access from all devices. You can do recordings in the cloud, file, and screen sharing in this automatic captioning available so you can chat in the group and there's no time limit on calls so the cons are only no waiting room for participants that join early and only person at a time can share this screen users privacy can be improved next is Microsoft Teams so with Microsoft Teams there's corroboration tools there's full integration with Office 365 there's video conferencing with background blur, recordings in the cloud, file and screen sharing, the instant messaging, access from all devices, tabs to make finding information easy, automatic captioning is available, no time limit on calls. So here with the cons are no waiting room for participants to join early, users privacy can be improved, no grid view like Google Meet or Zoom. So here's another comparison, Google Meet or Zoom. Those are the two most popular ones right now. Uh, there's the free option, yes on Zoom, no on uh, Google Meet. The price range is more affordable around here on Google Hangout. And then Zoom is $14.99 per, per host. Up to $250, up to 1000 and they both operate on both uh, Windows, Mac, and Android, iOS. You can call recordings, screen share, group message. You can integrate other Google services on here, but you, and you can integrate here too. Encrypted calls, poll. So it seems like it's a tight competition, but I, I would go with uh, Google Hangouts, and I'll tell you why. So with the Zoom bombing, the Zoom own security, they're public by default. So if users do not disable this function, anyone who has a link can join and share the screen. So the privacy and the security is not really there. Uh, only meeting creators and calendar owners can mute or remove other participants. So this, in the Google Meet, you can do both. You can do both, you can mute and unmute. And in Zoom, sometimes there's uh, hijackers, you know, they identify thing and they they share it so with Google meet they use 25 character string for meeting IDs which makes it almost hard to really get into it and privacy is non-negotiable so if you I have used all three of them 
and uh, this is how I'll rank them, in my opinion. Uh, I would go with the Google Meet first because it's so easy to do and anybody can join and there's privacy and security. Then I would go with Zoom next. Zoom as my number two because it's a really cool app and th they have many features that I don't think Microsoft Teams has. And then three, I'll go with Microsoft Teams. So those are the three comparisons for my Zoom, Microsoft Teams, and Google Meet. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching Network Cookie. See you in the next one.